Hello kindergartners. Today we are going to use our shapes to create some art. So we have our square, we have a circle, we have a rectangle, and we have a triangle. All right, the very first thing we're going to do is write our name on our paper. I like to put it in the bottom corner. I wrote Miss Thurrett, but you should write your name. Next, I'm gonna get my bag of shapes. Now, yours might be different colors than mine, but they're all gonna be red, blue, and yellow. But your triangle might be blue, and your circle might be red, but that's okay. So then you're gonna take your shape, put it on your paper, and trace around the outside. That might be a little tricky for some of us, but don't worry, it'll get easier the more that you do it. I traced my circle and square first because they're the bigger shapes that I have. Yours might be different, and that's okay. Notice how I'm using one of my hands to hold the shape in place, putting down some pressure, and then using the other hand and my pencil to trace on the outside. When I'm done with the shape, I put it to the side, and I grab my next one. The next step is going to be to color in your shapes. I matched mine to the shapes I had in my bag. So my rectangle is blue, I colored it blue. My square and my triangle were red, I colored them red. My circle was yellow, I colored it yellow. Now that we're done with our shapes, it's a good idea to put them back in the bag. That way, we can use them again another time. If you can't get the seal just right, don't worry. Miss Thurr can do it later. Give it a try. If it doesn't work, no big deal. Now for the fun part, we are going to use a Sharpie. Now it's really important when you take that cap off, we put it back on the back. I like to call that piggyback that cap. Repeat it after me, piggyback that cap. We're going to use the Sharpie to add some details, a face, arms, maybe some crazy hair. I'm going to speed the rest of this up so that we can get to art making. All right, friends, now it's your turn. 